Hi everyone, Henrik Stenson here. This is Team Majestic GC and we are doing Teammates 2.0. Right boys, this is serious now, okay? No goofing around. Which uh, character from a movie do I relate to most? It shouldn't take that long. Three numbers. <laughs> Alrighty? Yeah. Slee? Oh, you're not done yet. No, I've done it. You want the answer? Yeah, the Hulk. All right. Yeah, that's that's acceptable. Ian? That's not acceptable. I said three numbers, not three words. What do you mean three numbers? 007, it can't be that hard, can it? <laughs> what we got? Going for Viking. Viking, okay, that's also acceptable, so. All right. What do I think is the worst drink you can order in a bar? Lori? For anything alcoholic. Kind of, Lee? Espresso martini, because you don't like coffee and you don't like alcohol, so... Yeah, yeah, that's, that's not a, a bad disaster answer. for you, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, similar to Laurie's, anything alcoholic because you're a lightweight. Absolutely, but if I order something, it has to be shaken, not stirred, right? What is something I do that would be embarrassing if everyone found out? Lee? Sleeps naked. Playing with your butter mushroom. Shave your legs. Yeah, it'd probably be most em embarrassing if I shave my legs. Wouldn't that be that? There's what nothing you, wrong with shaving your legs. What do you think, Bolts? <laughs> uh, see what I'll I'm shave saying? everything. If I had to be one of you guys for the day, who would I pick? Bolts. Ah, it's me all day long. I'd, I'd put Westy. No, no, it's... I, I'd, I'd go for Pulse. I was like, oh, all right, all right. I just, yeah, yeah, I feel, I feel, yeah. We know you were a Scouser. Uh, it can be. Scouser, all right, all right. <laughs> no, but I just like, yeah. No, all right, I'll pick Pulse. I'll pick Pulse. All right, last one. What kind of shop would I open once I retire from the game? Pulse. It's a candy store. And if you know Henrik Stenson, every time he comes back from Sweden, every summer, he brings me four pounds of Swedish candy. Yeah, just to keep you in the Jabba the Hutt mode. Hey! I've, I've put a gym. I feel like that would be quite on brand for you. We might be onto something here. We could do a gym with a candy store right when you with, exit. With, with... What do we got? Well, it's not going to be a coffee station, is it? Bank. Oh, yeah. Yeah, all right. I've always yeah. considered you a yeah. potential banker. All right. Yeah. That much personality, do we? Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I think the gym with the candy store on the way out. You go in, you work hard, burn 1,200 calories, you buy four pounds of candy, and you gain 2,000 of them straight back on. Yeah, perfect. You heard it here first. Okay, guys, my turn. In a zombie apocalypse, which one of you three would I have on my side? Henrik. Stenson. What did you write? I'm always on your side. Yeah. Oh, sweet. That's nice. That's really nice. Uh, it would be Henrik, I think. There's a mixture of strategy and um, probably a certain amount of craziness that I think we'd need. Good. Question two, if I were an animal, who would I choose to be? <laughs> a rat. Uh, I put a panda. A panda? Yeah. A giraffe. If you've ever heard me make my eagle noise, you'll know that it, I'd, I'd be a bird. I'd be an eagle. Go on then. Man, that's not bad. It's good, isn't it? You see that rat rolled just a bit quickly, didn't it? Sorry, that was that was Laurie Cantor, by the way. That wasn't an eagle. We had the bird of prey from the back there. Yeah. Um, thank you. Good. I'm impressed. Yeah, thank you. I could impress you at something. A, a rat, rat bird. 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 Okay. Uh, question three. What would be my dream job? You have it. It's. It could be argued, but there's probably one more childhood one and um, football player lord of the manor uh i can't spell sommelier so i said wine taster that would that would be a great job barista that uh would probably actually be a rugby player that would that was sort of my childhood oh, you're dream not. job 
do too. Then, well, exactly. That's why it's a dream job. It's never going to happen. Like, you like your ears too much as well. Question four: What superpowers would I choose? Flying. Invisible. To be invisible. It is to be invisible. That's correct. That would be a pretty cool superpower. Question five: If I could have a lifetime supply of anything, what would I choose? If I could laugh in already. <laughs> red wine. Wine. Oh, okay, this this is two of my favourite things. It'd be red wine. Yep. Um, I'm rubbish at it. There we go. If I didn't play golf, what would I do? Keep it clean. Cut grass. Flip burgers. Flip burgers. <laughs> this is nice, isn't it? Let's see where this is going. But I'd be a world class drinker. He's already that. I'm already that. <laughs> Number two. If I could do any track and field event, what would I choose? Shot put. Shot put. Thanks. Shot put. Predictable. <laughs> what does that even say? The two metre sprint. Two metre sprint. There's only one of us in the gym this morning. Number three. Who do I think has the best fashion sense on the team? Henrik? I think that might be Henrik. Henrik. Me, me, me. You're learning a lot about the team here. What do you reckon? Probably Henrik. I'm not a big Tartan fan. We can cut to a few of Ian's old um, outfits there, can't we? The gold lame one. I've still got it. Did. I'll bring it to close house for you if you want. If I were a wrestler, what would be my special move? Double Nelson. Mm. Pile drive. I'll put the belly flop. Belly flop. I'd have to go with the belly flop. And this should be fairly easy for you lads, this one. Who would I want to play me in a film about myself? If they don't put Brad Pitt, I'll be very upset. Jack Black. I expected worse. I'll put Daniel Craig. Daniel Craig. Good see. This is where it all goes to shit. Jam of the heart. Well done. I think I got away with that. Okay, this is this is a really easy one to start us off. How many takes did it take me to pass my driving test? Answers, please. Seven. Four. Absolute knobhead. Oh, I put one. You're no, a good. No, I mean, no one got it right. I mean, that's uh, it was two. <laughs> <laughs> I was reversing around a corner, and some idiot decided to pull up behind me and wouldn't move. That was really nice. So I failed. Uh, what was my best excuse for turning up late for work? Yes, yes, I'm sure there's lots of, oh, he was doing his hair, or he was flat tire, use that one, yeah, that's a winner. Westy. Doing hair. Uh, I mean, I put hair so cut. predictable. No. Which one of the guys do I think would get a tattoo of Majestics on themselves? Westy. Me. Me, me and Westy. If I could party with any musician, who would I choose? Uh, 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 Staying alive. Yes, 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 yes. I put Elton John. Elton John. Yeah, to be, I, I, I quite like a bit of Elton John. Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. Absolute knobhead. I got no idea. Pass. No musician. What happened? Well, I wouldn't party with anyone, or you can't actually know. You don't know a musician. He likes EDM, so. Right, go, go DJ. Yeah, I mean, that's, I'm more thinking to find someone that want to party with you. I mean, like you could have chose Rod Stewart. I mean, you could have chose. Yeah, Rod Stewart. You could. Um, you could have a hair. Yeah, Rod Stewart. Yeah, you could have a hair we contest could have a hair with him. He was born on the same day as me, isn't it? All right, Rod it is. January. Rodney. Rod Stewart. Okay, if I could be the best in the world at anything other than golf, what would I choose? You don't want to start there. Really easy, boys. Really easy. Well, well, oh, race car driver. Well, well, you, I mean, there you go. That's called teammates right there. They know you very well. Thanks for tuning in to Team Majestic's GC 2.0.